Hey, my Taurus tribe. I'm coming to do a reading for my Taurus tribe as a collective, spraying the energy, some um, water, water, so we can make sure we have some good energy going on here. Okay. Um, I think I'm going to burn a little bit as well. Let's see. If I can find my little lighter. Well, I guess not. I mean, I'm not going to stop the video. So, with that being said, let's get into your reading. I hope y'all doing okay. All right, we're going to start off with getting messages first today. So, Spirit, give me what I need for my Taurus tribe. What is going on with my Taurus tribe? Clear, concise answers as I get what I need for my Taurus tribe as a collective. And yes, I waited. I didn't do my reading. I waited, I waited to do my reading with you all again. So Taurus Tribe, click the site answer spirit. All right. So let's shuffle a little bit. All right. I hope y'all doing well. Y'all, let me play a little bit of music. I hope y'all can't hear it though. This material harvest just flew out, okay? So we're going to definitely keep that. Give me a second. Okay. Um, Y'all, I'm such a music person. Okay, so material har harvest, okay? What else, Spirit? For my Taurus tribe. Give me what I need for my Taurus tribe. Click concise answers and messages. I ask for divine protection as I get these. Okay, you got harmony. Mmm. Looks like love to me. All right, what else, Spirit? Spirit, give me clear, concise answers. Okay, your sacral chakras. That's what your emotions. Okay, you got to work on your sacral chakra so you can express your emotions more. What else, Spirit? Oh. Okay. All right, you got triumph, okay. You got heartache and loss in reverse, and I'm keeping it just like that. Give me one more spirit. What else, spirit? Recognition and reward, okay. There we go. There y'all cards right there. At the bottom of the deck, you got you have spiritual strength. Okay. Let's see what's at the beginning. Okay. Put the record on hold. Okay. Let me see. You know what I see? I see that somebody probably are um I see right now that someone is opening up their heart chakra and expressing their emotions. Okay, your sacral chakra, your sacral chakra pretty much is what helps you express your emotions. And it's right there by the base chakra, okay? And in the harmony card, it shows that the heart chakra is lit in this card, okay? Let me show you. The heart chakra is lit, okay? And it looked like it was some heartache and loss that happened, but someone on triumph, somebody triumph above that and ready to express their love now. And spirit is recognizing you for that. Recognition and reward. That's coming from spirit, that recognition and reward, okay? And you have material harvests. Okay, so I see love and I see love and material harvest and the heartache and loss is, is done. Okay, um, this is going to be a triumph. Okay, you're going to triumph over this situation. Okay, let's get a few Kipper cards. Just a few. Just a few. Spirit, give me what I need for my Taurus tribe. Unexpected income. Hey, oh, okay. Ooh, okay. And this is expectation. 
all right? You have bad health and you have false person, okay? All right, so what's at the bottom of the deck? Okay, you got poverty at the bottom of the deck. All right, so that's okay. We're gonna figure out what this is. Okay, so unexpected income. Now that's that's pretty good. That's where the material harvest is coming from. Expectation. Um, yeah, we're gonna figure this out. Bad health. False person. Okay. I'm just trying to pick up the energy, y'all. Just give me a second. Mm -hmm. False person. Okay, so I can tell you this. When I see cards like this come out, it's not by, it's not a coincidence. Okay, when it's somebody around you that's not being they 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 they're they're portraying to be someone they're not. It could be, I'm going to give you one scenario and I can give you another. One scenario is that this false person can be pretty much madly in love with you and this person is not showing their emotions, okay? And that's why the sacred chakra is here. And this bad health is giving me the indication that someone, if someone has lost somebody, if someone has lost someone, you know, my condolences go to you, go out to you because this got the, this is bad health and this is heartache and loss. Even though heartache and loss is in reverse, this is giving me the energy that someone um, is getting over some heartache and loss in reference to a person. An expectation. Yes, you should be expecting. Uh, listen, and I'm just all for this. Expectation triumph. To me, that goes together. You should be expecting recognition and reward from spirit because you've been going through a whole lot, okay? Your material harvest, your love, recognition and reward. Yes, you should be expecting this. Uh, you should be, it, the expectation is it's time for you to go higher. It's time for you to get out this, it's time for you to get out this energy that you've been in, okay? So yes, yeah, spirit is definitely getting ready to, you're, you're being recognized for, for, pretty much going through what you have been through emotionally and coming out on top and you 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 went through it with flying color, colors and um spirit is recognizing you for that okay all right and you and you know triumph you know triumph over the situation okay your material harvest will begin you will have unexpected income you will be recognized and then you have harmony Yes, this is this is harmony is pretty much showing that your heart chakra. You like this is this is some love coming in, okay? Congratulations, okay. But this false person, this false this false person can be somebody that um. Just be careful with your friends and so called friends. Be careful with your so called friends, okay? They might not mean you any good. I don't know. Um, but what I can say is definitely is somebody false around you. And you just need to watch yourself, okay? Who you think your friend might not be your friend, okay? And then you got to be authentic. The way, your way is the only way for you, okay? No matter what you have done, no matter what you're doing, you don't have to mimic anybody, okay? You have to make sure that you stay in your vibration. Be you, long as you be authentic you will succeed okay but if you try to be like somebody else you're not gonna succeed okay because that's you, you're trying to be something you're not okay all right let's get a couple more of these what up spirit yeah we're gonna post these messages first okay what up spirit 
Spirit, give me what I need for my Taurus tribe. Good, concise answer, Spirit. What's going on with my Taurus tribe? Woo, there we go. Okay. Let go of a fixed plan. Allow for um, spontaneity and growth. Okay. So you want to be, um, you want to. You want to try to let go of having a fixed plan with everything, okay? And let spirit flow in your life, okay? Watch how everything just work out for you. And spirit is saying that you are a bright energy. Colors uplift you. So that's for my people that like the, my Taurus tribe that like to wear uh, black all the time. Black or gray. Uh-uh. You got to get out of that. Spirit is letting you know that you look good in colors. So go ahead and start um, incorporating some colors into your life, into your wardrobe. Y'all, a lot came out and I'm keeping it, okay? Stay the course. You are moving in the right direction. Spirit is very proud. That's why the recognition and reward card is here, okay? And it's saying that um, you are worthy. Aim for what you want and believe in yourself, okay? Because you have triumphed over this, this situation, okay? You have triumphed over this heartache and loss, okay? And then you have a sensitive antenna. Sensitive people collect the emotions of others. And this is so true. Tauruses are very sensitive people. Very sensitive. We pick we could come into a room and sense that something is wrong automatically. We can we, we could be talking to somebody on the phone and notice the tone change. And it's just that's just who we are, okay? You are unlimited. What you can create is unlimited. So whatever you're trying to do, whatever you're trying to create. Trust me, it's going to be successful, okay? So following the path for another, your path is being redirected to where it should be. Meaning, this is the second card. Spirit is pretty much saying, spirit don't, spirit don't want you trying to be like somebody else. Spirit wants you to be authentic. Because right now, you being authentic is where your money is. That's where this unexpected income is going to going to come in, okay? That's where your material harvest and this love going to come from. You being you. You being authentic. You can't be authentic trying to follow somebody else's path, okay? Their path, that whoever path that you're trying to follow or who that you think you're mimicking, stop now. Because spirit is not going to bless you, okay? They're not going to bless you because... If they, if you, if you, if you're not being yourself, spirit don't know who, look who you're trying to be. You know, you got to be real because spirit know who you are. All right, spirit, give me a couple more messages. Mm hmm. These are the angel messages. But we're gonna, we're gonna touch on this false person. Ah, you know, I don't want to put too much energy on that. Just, just watch out. Okay. You must be you must be on a uh, uh you must be doing what you're supposed to do because that's when these these type of cards come out. False person don't come out unless you're doing what you got to do. People don't um people don't people don't want you to get ahead of them, okay? So somebody is watching you, somebody is jealous, okay? All right. So give me what I need, spirit. Quick concise answers. Okay, spirit say now that you ask for um guidance, um be open to assistance and 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 you deserve he uh, heaven's uh help heaven is here you know the spirit guides are here to help you you know whatever it is that you need you have prayed about it you have asked about it you have you've been manifest you've been meditating on it and you have manifested their help okay they're going to help you and they're going to give you the guidance that you need so you could be okay all right spirit give me what i need what else, spirit? What else, spirit? Okay. Oh, marriage. You see that? I'm the angel of marriage and I'm assisting you right now. Okay. So this got something to do with the harmony card. Okay. This harmony card is letting me know that you have triumphed. And this time, it's somebody, I'm telling y'all, somebody's going to get married. Somebody, this is a marriage card. A, a great bit of y'all are going to get married. And if that's your expectation, stay right there. Okay. That's your recognition reward right here. The recognition and reward is that marriage for you, honey. If, if you if you want to get married, that's what's getting ready to happen for you, okay? If if it's not marriage, if you want to be in a committed relationship, that's fine. That's that's the same the same thing as marriage, okay? Yeah. What else, spirit? What else, spirit? Okay. Okay, you got Grace and Antoinette. Okay, so someone um again. 
Somebody has probably had an argument with someone or a disagreement, and you just need to see both sides of the specter. Don't don't just look at your side and think that um, it's just, you know, that person, okay? You got to have compassion for everybody else, okay, Taurus? We can be, we can be a little stubborn, all right? But let's not act like that. We got to... We gotta see it from all angles. Now, I'm not gonna even lie. Some people do try you, <laughs> and it is what it is, honey. These people that you can't show compassion sometimes, and I get it. So, it's this is fifty fifty, yin yang. I'm just saying. Spirit, give me what else? Give me, give me a few more cards, spirit. What else, spirit? Boom. Okay, you got. I'm the angel of peace. I bring you to uh, tranquility and a smooth, smoother road ahead. So this is spirit recognizing you. You got a smoother road ahead coming for you, um, to my Taurus tribe. We, we, you know, I have to always say it's been hard because we've been going through certain things, and we could have been some, some, some of us could have been in bad health. I just got over get, having a, a really bad headache for a week. Okay. Um, and so I'm not saying that's bad health. I'm just saying that's a part of my health though. Okay. That's done. But you know, at the end of the day, this false person and heartache and loss and the bad health, listen, spirit is going to recognize you for triumph. You triumph and, um, through all these situations and they're proud of you because look at here, new romance is in imminent. Either with a newcomer or through, through reunited passion in your existing relationship, be open to giving and receiving. Okay, be open to be, be open to giving and receiving love. Okay, that's you got three cards. You got three cards that's stating that you're going to be in a successful relationship. This is um, the marriage card, and you got harmony, and you have the and what's the name? Chantel, Chantel card. Yeah, this is love, okay? All right? And I'm so happy, all right? This is this is what's up, okay? All right? I think this is it. I'm going to shuffle one more time. If something come out, it does. If it doesn't, it doesn't. And it didn't. Okay, so that's it for that deck. Okay, so we're going to get you some romance angels today. Okay, we're just going to... I'm pulling out the messages, and then we're going to go to tarot, Okay? Okay, so Spirit, give me what I need for with the Romance Angels. Okay. Spirit, give me what I need. Clear, concise answers for my cards tribe. What is this? Oh, okay. All right, you need to have heart-to-heart -heart conversations. Honestly, discuss your feelings with each other because this is the only way things are going to come out and... and, and you all can proceed forward, okay? Heart to heart conversations, okay? Engagement. Hello, I told y'all somebody finna get married. They'll grow a, a, a bit. Uh, I think a bit chunk of y'all about probably about to get married. Your love life is ascending to a higher level of commitment. Look at here, you got marriage and engagement, okay? And you got the Chantel card and you got harmony. That is, listen, that is what's up. That is what's up. I am so happy. Spirit, give me a few more. Playfulness. Spirit wants you to be playful. Uh, to recapture romance, allow your inner youthful spirit to have fun and shine. Okay? All right. This is this is a very lighthearted reading. Romantic feelings. Your feelings are, are real and worth exploring. Okay, there we go. Chemistry, okay? There is a strong magnetic attraction here. Y'all better do it. <laughs> I'm so happy for y'all, okay? Let's see what's right here. Okay, religious religion factor, religious factors, okay? So this religious factors um, may have a, uh, may be trying to play an issue in your romantic life, but we're not gonna even put issues on that because this, this heart to heart conversation We'll make sure that um, that's taken care of, okay? I'm pretty sure that you all will discuss that. You have engagement, playfulness, romantic feelings, and we're going to put that right there. And we have um, Fiona. We got the, uh, the compassion card. You got the marriage card, and you have another love card. Mm-hmm. Oh, yeah. So let's see. We're going to put these 
Yeah, we're gonna go ahead and put these over here as well. Okay. And we're gonna gather these. Unexpected income, expectation, false person, bad health. Like I said, if you haven't been feeling well, please get better, okay? All right. And I really hope you feel I really do hope you feel better, okay? All right, so we're gonna put these right here. Okay. Hmm. Put this peace card over here. Okay. So we're gonna um let's see, let's see. Okay, yeah, we're gonna move these too. Okay, because I just wanted to make sure we get all the messages we can. Spirit wants you to be authentic, you are worthy, you are unlimited. Spirit wanna want you to add some color into your life. Add some get some start wearing color. Stop get out that black and gray and <laughs> it's it's time it's time to put some color in your wardrobe, okay? Color brightens you up, okay? Okay, you are worthy. Aim for what you want and believe is your believe it believe in yourself, okay? Stay the course. You're moving in the right direction. Okay. But spirit is also letting you know that you were you were trying to follow the, at the bottom of the deck, it was saying that you was trying to follow the path of some of someone else and they're redirecting you. That's that's not what they want from you, okay? All right, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and get some tarot now. We're going to start with the tarot, get, get a few few cards, and then we'll get some more messages for you at the end, okay? Spirit, give me what I need for my cards. Five clear, concise answers. All right, clear, concise answers for my Taurus tribe, okay? Spirit, give me what I need. And when I'm picking up, oh, okay, now I get what this false person might be. You, Somebody was in a relationship with somebody that just wasn't right. And now that that relationship is over, that relationship is over. Who, whoever whoever was in a relationship with somebody, they were not that they were not being authentic. Not only were they not being authentic, authentic, they was the false person. They wasn't showing their feelings. They just, they, yeah, they wasn't right. Okay. All right, spirit, give me what I need. Clear, concise answer, spirit. Okay, let's see. Okay, give me what I need, Spirit. Okay, here we go. You got the towel at the bottom of the deck, okay? Okay, the towel and what's, what else? Okay, it's going to shock you. Somebody going to come in with the law or what the, to express their love to you, and that's going to shock you, okay? All right? Spirit, give me what I need. Clear answers for my cars, tribe. Okay, you got the seven of swords. Okay, there go that false person card, that, that sneakiness. You got um the eight of pentacles. What else, Spirit? You got the eight of wands. You have the page of cups. What else, Spirit? Two came out. You got the Queen of Cups and the Tower. It came right on out. Let me get one more. Spirit, I need one more. Please, just one more. Just one more. There we go. Ten of Swords. There we go. Okay. So, what I'm seeing right now is that with this false person, whoever this was, um, they they were. They was in some sneaky energy. Okay? There was somebody, somebody that, yeah, and they they... They they backstabbed you. Okay? They backstabbed you. Ten of swords. Okay. And what it did was it did cause a towel. And you got the heartache and loss card in reverse. So whatever this was, you got over it. Okay. It's not no it's, it's the heartache and loss is, is gone. Okay. And so you decided to dive into your work. So you've been working really, 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 really hard. Okay. You've been focusing on yourself. Trying to stay focused, trying to make sure that you have everything you need. Um, but this false person is looking back at you because they see that you are working hard, okay? And what you got to do, you got to stay focused when you're dealing with these type of people. When they see that you're doing good, your money's good, and that you're focused, and that your material harvest is good, and and 
you getting recognized and unexpected income and they see your blessings they're gonna try to come back around so expect this the expectation expect this false person to try to come back around okay they sneaky the sneaky energy you have to be very careful and then you got the eight of wands and you got the page of cups the page of cups is basically um somebody coming in with a, a love offer or some text messages with apology and it might be this false person i'm not gonna even lie I'm picking up that this false person, this false person is going to try to come in with some messages and offer you an apology. After they done backstabbed you, they caused a tower and they're coming in with the apology and then a love offer to express their love. Uh-uh. That ain't, uh-uh. No, unacceptable. Because they see, they see the, they see that, you know, that spirit is really blessing you. Spirit is blessing you from this 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 sabotage, this this, this loss that, that that you went through with them. They see how spirit has brought you out and how spirit is recognizing you. Okay, that's coming from spirit, honey. That's why your material um your material uh, harvest is go is good. Okay, that caused a tower moment, but you got over that, honey. You wasn't, you were uh-uh. You was like, I'm not finna stay in this energy. I'm finna get my money right. I'm finna work on me. And I'm finna make sure that I stay on top of my game. And you did that, okay? That's why this heart heartache and loss is in reverse, okay? Mm-hmm. They, the, they caused the tower, okay? And they think they're gonna have a victory coming in with you, but I'm not gonna even lie. This victory and this love is not coming from them. The victory and this love is coming from some somebody. I don't. I don't know. This. I don't know if this. Is, I don't know. I just know that this person spirit has really, spirit has really elevated you through this recognition and reward card because you have went through this heartache and lost like a G, like straight up. Okay, this person hurt you, and they try. They gonna try to come back in with some messages. So come after self-imposed mental prison. Don't 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 even let them even think that you trying to get them another chance, okay? Because whatever they did, it hurt you to your core. That's why you that's why these swords is in your back. Okay. All right, Spirit, give me a few more cards, okay? Let's see what's going on. Yeah, this false person, they they've been they've been watching. I'm, I'm, I don't even see the stalking card. But this false person is giving me the vibes that they've been they stalking and watching you somehow, some way, okay. But you you will have victory. You you will you you got the victory. This is this is this is for the Tauruses that's been doing this inner work. That's this that's been sitting here working hard. That's not sitting here um wallowing in this heartache and loss in this pain. Spirit is proud of you. You have eight eight eight. Mm-hmm. Eight eight eight. That's abundance. Look up that look up that number. Okay. That equals abundance. All right. What else, spirit? In a second. What else, spirit? Yep, that equals abundance. Y'all, y'all, congratulations. Like straight up. Recognition and reward. That's spirit. Okay. Give me one more shot for spirit. Okay. But if this is not this false person, you have somebody coming in with a love offer, express their love, and this is gonna oh, this gonna um it's gonna be harmony when they come in, and this is gonna be um pretty much it's gonna you know the start of a new romance or a rekindled romance like the um this card said this can be. This could be a new romance or it could be uh, a rekindle or reconciliation. So it could be a new or reconciliation when we're talking about this love. But it's giving me the vibe that somebody want to come in and apologize. So it could be, it's both. Okay, this is a reconciliation and this can be new love for people, okay? All right, let's see. All right, Spirit, give me what I need. Give me a few more cards, Spirit. What else, Spirit? Give me what else I need, Spirit. Okay, you got the Emperor. 
and you got the page of pentacles okay so this emperor this is this is this is Aries energy, okay? So you have Aries, you got Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. You have Aries, um, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. And you have Aries, okay? This, this, this emperor, this emperor is getting their life together. Not only is this emperor getting their life together, this emperor got a page of pentacles off of that they're coming towards you with, okay? I can't say that something is wrong with this person's money because I'm not picking that up. But this is a page. This might be a gift that they're bringing towards you, okay? But they are somebody coming in with a love offer, okay? Or an, an apology. One is an apology. One is a love offer, okay? And this is a gift. Okay, and they um they've been using their in, they've been in using their intuition so they can come on through. This is Pisces energy. Okay, all right, and let's see. All right, let me see what this this is saying something to me right here. Um, you got this Queen of Cups, the Ten of Swords, and this High Priestess. Okay. I think Spirit is trying to let you know. Seriously, this is confirmation what I said. This person, this sneaky person, this person is the person that's coming in with this love offer. This person with this love offer is the one that stabbed you in your back. This is the person that created a major loss in your life, okay? And spirit wants you to use your intuition, okay? Don't 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 fall for, for what this person is coming in with, okay? All right? So that's confirmation what I just said. Thank you, spirit. Okay, so we're going to leave that out because that, that is true. Well, you see it, right? All right. You got the Queen of Cups. They're coming in. But this is the person that hurt you. Okay? This is the person that hurt you. And it has something to do with a family dynamic. Yeah, that caused the ending. Yeah, that caused the ending. Oh, my goodness. It's pretty much... Yeah, it's every it's everything that I said. You got the three three uh swords. They hurt you, and they, there you go, the Queen of Pentacles. Okay, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, and you got there to go the Eight of Pentacles again. You dived into your work and you did what you had to do for yourself. You worked and you you got out that energy. You got the Ten of Cups. This was a family dynamic, and this person coming in, this person coming in is the person that hurt you. Okay. And spirit wants you to use your intuition and not go back to that, okay? It's up to you. You do what you got to do. You're going to be at a crossroads. And it's, it is showing that this person is somebody from your past. There we go. Wow. Okay? I mean, spirit just summed that up, okay? That's a reconciliation from something. You got to make up your mind if this is something that you want, okay? Because they, they broke your heart, okay? And this is you. This is the queen of pentacles. Okay, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, but we're talking about Taurus. Okay, this is the Eight of Pentacles. You don't, you 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 started working and got focused because you this ended. Your family dynamic ended, and this person is coming back in trying to offer you this cup of love. Mm -hmm. And this is the person. Mm -mm, this is the person that stabbed you in the back, and they probably would end up doing it again if you let them back in. I'm I'm being so honest. And this is the High Priest is telling. This is Spirit telling you to use your intuition with this. Okay. All right. All right. Let's shuffle these cards again. Okay. All right. Here we go. What else, spirit? Okay. So this emperor, other than that, this emperor, somebody, you know, outside of this false person that I just summed up, this is a good reading because I do see I do see that it is going to be a successful successful relationship. And you got the King of Pentacles at the bottom of the deck, and you got the Temperance card telling you to be to be patient. And this is a reconciliation with whoever you're talking about. And this is clarity. Mm -hmm. This is truth and clarity. Okay, you got uh, this is a celebration. This can be an engagement. Okay, because you did have you do have engagement and marriage up there. Okay, so you got this could be a reconciliation or this can be engagement, marriage. This can be patient. This in spirit is telling you to be patient, but they also bring a balance to the situation. And they go to King of Pentacles right here, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Okay, this is awesome. This is Sagittarius energy. Okay. All right, all right. This is this is really nice. Okay, let's see what else, spirit. You got the Queen of Wands, Queen of Swords at the bottom of the deck. Okay, let's see. What up, spirit? 
High Priestess, use your intuition. Mm-hmm. Ooh. So three came out. Okay. So Spirit is, you know, you've been using your strength and um, you've been using your strength to get over this heartache. But you still are in this. You got, you see, you got to take, you got to get out the self-imposed method prison. It came out twice. I don't know what you're trying not to see. But Spirit wants you to come out this energy and use your intuition, okay? Come out this energy because Spirit is trying to bring justice to this situation for you, okay? This is Libra. This is Leo. Pisces, okay? Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, okay? So, come out this energy so you can um, definitely receive your blessings, okay? Because uh, this is this is gonna be this is gonna be a new beginning, and sometimes again, sometimes when we've been hurt, we we have the swords of our eyes, eyes because we don't trust. Okay, we think everybody's in that same energy, but when you don't heal, you don't heal, and it's as simple as that. Okay, somebody's trying to hold on to you. Not only are they holding on to you, they might be holding back some money. If they're not holding back their money, they just you know they they just. They're holding on to you and holding back from something. Okay, let's see what this is. Are they holding back or holding on? <laughs> They've been holding back and holding on to you, but they finna come with these rapid messages. This is the ace, uh, the eight of wands because this is the second time the eight of wands done came out as well. Spirit, give me what I need. Okay, this is the three of pentacles. They want this collaboration with you now. Okay, Spirit, I need to see some love. I need to see. I already know it's going to be some love, but um, especially with the marriage up there. But what else, Spirit? Yep, somebody moving away. The common waters. Let me see. What else, Spirit? So this person, this person does want a collaboration with you. Spirit is getting you ready. I told you they were spying. The, 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 sneak, the sneaky person, the sneaky person that I summed up at the beginning, this person is spying on you, okay? Because you moved away from them. But also, it's going both ways. You you still got somebody else that's spying on you as well. And they want to move towards you so they can um have this collaboration, okay? All right, justice is here. It's going to be a marriage. I'm telling you, it's going to be a marriage, okay? The message cards done said it. It's going to be a marriage. This person is spying on you. You got the king You got the king of pentacles here. And then somebody is um, thinking about this offer, okay? But they in a mental prison, okay? They, in this, they, they, in the, they have a mental conflict about this offer, okay? Because maybe they've been hurt or you've been hurt. Take it how it resonates, okay? Feeling left out in the cold, okay? So they're weighing their options. You got the Hierophant and you got the High Priestess, a divine, a divine connection. And you got the Emperor and the Empress, okay? You can't make this up, okay? This is your divine counterpart, whoever this person is. I'm not talking about the false person, okay? I'm not talking about the false person. You see this? This is your divine counterparts. Y'all divine counterparts, Okay? There will be a reconciliation. There will be an engagement. It will be marriage. Okay, here go justice. Mm hmm. Libra energy. Mm hmm. They they're trying to figure out when they're coming in with this awful. Mm hmm. Oh yeah, this is this is definitely gonna be a marriage. Okay, it's gonna take strength because this person gave me the vibes that they don't deal with their emotions. Okay. All right. So um, let's see. <sighs> Let's see. Let me get a few more cards and we're going to end this reading and get y'all some more messages. What else, Spirit? Okay, you got the Queen of Wands. I'm sorry, the Queen of Swords. Very intelligent queen. Um, maybe you in your Queen of Swords energy and maybe Spirit is telling you to get in your Queen of Swords energy for when this false person try to come back and bring you this love offer, okay? <laughs> you, that's why spirit wants you to get in that, that queen of swords energy because that person is not worthy and I can't make this up. The king and the queen of wands came out at the same time. So that was already beside each other, a divine counterpart. Okay. So whoever you dealing with, this person is your divine counterpart and somebody is carrying a heavy load. Somebody, somebody is carrying a lot. Okay. Somebody is carrying a whole lot. They got a lot going on right now. And, um, yeah, they they gonna have to loose, loosen up on this load for a while. You know, by the time they come to you, because this is a lot. But you you are dealing with their divine counterpart, okay? But that false person that's coming in who hurt you, think twice 
Okay, think twice before you let this person come back in, okay? I can't tell you what to do. I can just only instruct you. This person, they, they still in sneaky energy. They're not, they don't mean you any good, okay? And the tower brought this down for a reason. You came out of heartache and loss successfully. So, why, yeah, so don't, you know, spirit is recognizing, recognizing you for that, okay? What else, spirit? Okay, you got the Knight of Pentacles. Okay, somebody being strategic because they're coming in and they want this equal give and take after this ending. Okay, if they went through a complete ending. You went through a complete ending. And whatever is getting ready to come in, it's gonna be for your benefit. It's gonna you're gonna get it's definitely a, a reciprocity here. Okay. And I know all of us want that reciprocity. Okay. You got the devil energy at the bottom of the deck that's giving me that false that false person energy. Whoever this person is, they keep creeping back into this reading, okay? They are really, really coming coming for you, okay? They're going to come for you. I'm trying to tell you what I know. You got the nine of wands, okay? They're the wounded warrior, okay? They're wounded. They've been fighting, mm -hmm. and then they, they have regret of what they did, but they're still hiding stuff, <laughs> So what I'm seeing is they um they at a crossroads, okay? They go to Queen of Pentacles. You had the you got the King of Pentacles. And you know you had the King of Pentacles as well. Something is hidden. What's hidden is this person is in regret. They hate the way they did you, okay? So this is a reconciliation for some of you, okay? And it can be that false person or that person that hurt you, okay? Just make sure you use your intuition. That's all spirit wants you to do. Use your intuition. That's why the high priestess was here, okay? Some of y'all, take them back. Some of them, just make sure you use your intuition. But right now, mm, just make sure, like I said, just make sure you, 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 you cover yourself with this, okay? Okay, but this person won't reciprocity. But for everyone else... This is new love. New love is here. Okay. A new love is here. And it's going to be reciprocity. Yeah. You have you have successfully went through your heartache and pain. And spirit is getting ready to bless you immensely. Okay. And congratulations to you. So let me get, get some more. Um, Let's get some more cards. Um, some more message cards. And we're going to go ahead and wrap this reading up. Okay. Let's see. Let me, no, I'm going to start off with these right here first. Okay. All right. Y'all, when I do our reading, I be, I be pulling up everything, don't I? <laughs> okay, here we go. So this person that hurt you, you never know. This person that hurt you probably going through something some bad health they might have oh like i'm like seriously this person might be going through some, through some health issues okay and then you know the emperor the empress came out and the empress is you okay the empress is you and with that being said that's taurus and libra um the empress pretty much is a healer <laughs> okay that's why this person might be coming back Wow, okay, I got cards, other cards mixed up in these cards. Let me show you what I got mixed up in these cards, y'all. And I don't know why they mixed up in here, but there go the Empress again. That's you, Taurus, Libra, and there go death and re somebody going through a rebirth. Wow, okay, I'm keeping it. I mean, I'm, I don't know how they got in there, but that's okay. Here we go, Spirit, give me what I need. It's a new beginning here. Somebody going through a rebirth. Mm -hmm. I'm awake now. They say, I'm awake now. I love you more than I thought possible. I love everything about you. Yeah, you, yeah, y'all, y'all have really successfully did what you had to had to do as far as healing yourself and healing heartache and loss, probably from generations or when you was a little child. And now spirit is blessing you. You get ready to have reciprocity. I'm saying good things to you about to you about to my friends. I'm saying I'm saying good things about you to my friends. Okay. And this person say I've been looking at your photos. It did show somebody is stalking. Okay. What else, spirit? What else, spirit? Uh huh. Okay. This person say I want to hold hold and feel you so badly. They say, I'm sorry. 
I let my pride get in the way. And this person said they, they have to sort some things out. That's what they've been doing. They've been sorting a lot of things out. And you have too. Okay? You have too. So you can honestly sit here and say besides that false person and what they did, y'all pretty much are mirroring each other because you did have, remember, you did have the, um, you had the the um, Hierophant and the High Priestess. You had the Emperor and the, and the Empress. And you had the King and the Queen of Pentacles. You had the King and the Queen of Wands. This is your divine counterpart. And that's just simple as that. Okay. You, and somebody, because this person is going through a financial situation. That's why they got to sort some things out. They don't want to come to you broke. You see, and I, you remember the Emperor had that um, Page of Pentacles. That's all they, that, that's all they had. Okay, they had the Page of Pentacles uh, offer bringing to you. I thought it was a gift, but it's showing that they got financial issues. This person said, I can't get you off my mind. Okay, all right. High Priestess Energy. This person said, I miss you much. Okay, what else? They say, if you give me another chance, I promise to make things right. Okay, all right. That's enough from that deck. So let's come over here and get some more messages. Okay, so you will listen. <laughs> You are on the right path, Taurus. I am so happy for you. You all are triumphing, you know, through all of these situations. It's no more heartache and loss, okay? Last week it said it was the obstacles and challenges was over, okay? <laughs> Pretty much. No more heartache and loss. You know, it's time, it's time for you to walk in your power, walk in love, okay? All right? Get ready, honey. This is beautiful. Spirit, recognize your work. Spirit... Spirit recognize that you've been you've been definitely doing the work that you're supposed to do. What else, Spirit? And maybe this false person done change. Maybe maybe a reconciliation is in store for you all. I don't know. You you would know. Just use your intuition, okay? I'm just letting the cards fall and I'm gonna read them once I get through, okay? Let me get this one. Okay. Let me make sure this one did flip. Okay. What else? What else? What else? What else? Okay. That's it. Okay. Fear. I want this so badly, but I'm afraid of getting hurt. So I self-sabotage. You see that? They self-sabotage. No strings. Okay. I want you close to me, but I'm not ready for a commitment. This person not ready. I don't think this is what this person is saying now. I think this was a part of that past energy that they had going on, that false person. Yeah, they wanted you close to them, but they didn't want no relationship with you. And they sabotaged it. They, it said it's sabotaged right here. Okay? That's exactly what they did. They sabotaged this. And this is why, because they, they were scared. Mask. Honestly, I pretend to be someone I'm not because being vulnerable feels uncomfortable. Okay? So, they, they're letting you know that they're uncomfortable being themselves. Okay? And that might be what when these, these messages are saying. Because they're saying, be authentic. <laughs> and uh the way your way is the only way for you so this person has been wearing a, a false mask okay spirit is saying within a year or more okay i don't know what that mean it could mean i don't know what that mean okay but whatever it is it's within a year or more maybe you got to plan your wedding who knows okay um i hear something from you and i'm afraid to tell you about it see mm -hmm. this person hasn't been honest false person okay personal this isn't about you i'm working through a personal issue see this person got some some serious issues going on okay this has nothing to do with you but spirit is proud of you okay this person is worried i'm not sure if this is a good idea i'm overthinking everything what would everyone else think so this is giving me the vibes that it might be some religious factors again because that's what came out in the romance angels but it's also giving me the vibe that it might be an age difference or you might look different or this person has a certain image, you know, he, they're, they're trying to uphold, okay? Gentle, I am staying away from you because the last thing I want to do is hurt you, okay? So this person, as you see, I don't think I've seen any, I didn't, I don't think I've seen any charging cards. This person is still going through some things, but at the end of the day, spirit is proud of you. So you just continue to glow 
and glow up and let this person sit there and watch, I promise you they're coming in, okay? But your new love, for the ones that's got new love, baby, you're getting married. <laughs> it, it, just, it just is what it is. You're getting married. Spirit is, is, is congratulating you. You deserve it. You don't want through the heartache and pain. And you're ready, okay? Spirit just wants you to probably maybe work on your um sacral chakra a little bit more. Just listen to some sacral um chakra um, meditations. Because what that'll do is that'll help you express your emotions better, okay? Spirit, give me what I need. Give me what I need, Spirit. Let them fall out. And I can get a few more after this. Let's see. Okay, you got poker face. Um, this this says um, taking a chance, risk, and option, not showing hand. So this person always had a poker face on. They want again. They wanted you, <laughs> false person, poker face. They wanted you close, but they wasn't ready for a commitment. Mm hmm. Not today. Boundaries hurt. Avoid conversation. Not dealing. Still upset. This person still got some issues. I told you clock but this person know that you're not finna wait on them the per this person know that they better come on in okay they still they say they still need some time okay all right and this is the runner mm -hmm. the runner okay you got the this person is a runner this is for the ones that's dealing with the false person and somebody coming back for a reconciliation this person is a runner this this person is a false person this person, um, then I don't know about now, but this person sabotaged this relationship because they um, they they didn't know how to be themselves, okay, and they they scared of getting hurt, okay. So it looks like they're healing their heart, okay, but it does show that they are coming in. It's gonna be a sudden change, okay. They are coming in. Let's see, what else, spirit? What else, spirit? What else, spirit? So this is two reasons in one, pretty much. Cut down, cutting down separation, the pattern, silent treatment. So that's what you're getting from this person right now, from this false person. This false person is giving you the silent treatment, and maybe they just, maybe, maybe, maybe they just again working through some issues. Okay, all right, but they, they, they really played. They, they really been playing. They've been, they've been really um using their poker face. And, 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 you know, causing chaos for no reason, okay? That's their insecurities that they are not ready to be in a, in a relationship. Stalking, uh-huh, the sunglasses, stalking, um, the ship, okay? They progressing, they doing what they got to do, okay? And this is the thing, now it's making sense. This person, yes, y'all went through a separation, but this is for the reconciliation people, but this is, y'all went through a reconciliation, but for the one, other ones, okay. Oh, the mask came out twice, y'all. Look at here. Oh, wow. So this person, so this person has been like seriously wearing a mask. Okay, so y'all just be careful with this person. Okay, be careful, okay. This seduction, um, attraction, teasing, hooking up, third party temptation, okay. Um, cutting ties, the shipment, uh, the ship has come in, um, moving on, receive what you need, progression arriving, okay. This person is coming in. This person got a lot of outdated thinking, okay. This person has a lot of outdated thinking, okay, and replaying events. This person, this person just is not secure right now, but you are, okay. All right, don't let this stop you from genuine love, okay? Sunglasses, watching, looking, perception, stalking. This person's stalking you. And it's so sad that this is your soulmate. <laughs> this is your soulmate. Yeah, this person, look, this person, like, this is just so much. This person has addictions. Yeah. Emotionally, they emotionally blocked. But I can tell you like this. Whoever this new love coming in, whoever this new love coming in, you better get ready. Mm -hmm. Or maybe when this person, this person is working on their issues and they're trying to fix what they done broke, what they done sabotage. Okay. They're trying to repair. Yeah. They don't sabotage it. So now they're going to probably try to come in and rebuild it. And I, and, and I'm the first one to say people do change. Okay. 
people change. Mm -hmm. And it looks like this person, they, they, they want to change. And maybe this, maybe, you know, maybe you will marry this person. I don't know, but I'm just saying you got some new love coming in as well. But look, this Phoenix new phase, rekindle, renew growth, change your mind, rise from the ashes. Boom. So this person is working on themselves. Okay. This false person, they're working on themselves. Period. Point blank. All right, but for the ones that um, that has new love coming in, this is a this is for this is this reading go can go both ways. This could either be a rec a reconciliation or this can and a reconciliation is new love, okay. But this can also be a totally new person coming into your life, okay. But these messages right here that I just from this deck, it's giving me the vibes that this person is pretty much coming back in for a reconciliation, okay. This is the person that you've been dealing with. This is your this is your divine counterpart. And even if it is a totally new person, this person is your divine counterpart because you had so many um, matches in the tarot, okay? But this person has been wearing a mask. This person, they've been false. They've been, they've been wearing a mask. This is the false person, okay? All right. My Taurus tribe, this is y'all's reading. And I know they love you, okay? They miss you, but they're going through some financial situations, okay? All right? And they um they do want this new beginning. They're going through a rebirth, okay? So if this person is somebody from your past, you use your intuition. That's all spirit wants you to do. Use your intuition and make sure you make the right decision for yourself, all right? And then um, if this is a to totally new love, it don't matter if it's a reconciliation or a totally new love. Either or, spirit is saying that it's going to be harmony, they recognize that you have overcame this heartache and loss and you, you don't triumph over it and it's going to be harmony. Okay. That's all the love right there. Okay. And then you got material harvest. Okay. Your money, your money, your material harvest, harvest is going to be good because spirit recognize you and spirit is congratulating you with that. Okay. You do have love. You got the, um, you got the, you got Chantel, you got the marriage card, like seriously. And then the romance, the romance angel said that you, um, pretty much engagement, have heart to heart conversation, playfulness, romantic feelings. Yes, this is, this is, this is beautiful. Whatever this is, just use your intuition. I'm happy for you. Spirit is proud of you. And I am um, pretty much done with this reading, <laughs> okay? You all have a great night. I love you all so, 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 so much. And you all take care. Bye.